Atlantis Hotel in Dubai and I've been joined today by Nervzo. How are you guys doing? You've played with some quite cool people over the time like um, Machine Head, um, The Darkness, is that right? And uh, were they cool? <laughs> I can tell by your face. Justin Hawkins, <laughs> nice guy. And uh, also, was it last year you opened for like Metallica? Like That's yeah. pretty sick. Who was the most cool kind of act that you got to play alongside? Um, I think um, uh, First, Suffocation, yeah. for sure. We did a UK European tour with them. And uh, just really nice guys. Shared a bus with them for 30 days. You know, all throughout Europe and UK. Latest album is called Psychogenocide, which I love that name, by the way. Um, how do you think you've evolved since Human Chaos EP came out? Well, musically a lot. Um, just naturally, you know, progression in the band. Um, experimenting, uh, a little more technical, obviously. Uh, still extreme metal, but uh, we got into some uh, Arabian influences. James yeah. wrote some, you know, Arabic lyrics with one of the tracks, put some percussions in there. Um, a little oriental sounding and also experimented with the gears and produced it ourselves, so massive production. Wicked. Um, You've done everything yourselves. Yeah, well, it's the, the album itself in the tour. It was mixed in Poland, mastered in uh, Poland, tracked in Dubai and guitar, and uh, drums in Australia. considered pioneers in uh, UAE, well they, they say, for um, kind of bringing out death metal music where there's so much mainstream music and kind of saying, hey guys, we are metal. How does that feel? Um, generally, like, we're proud to be one of one of the more the band that raises the metal flag internationally from the UAE. So. I love that. So right now, we just want to prove to people and bands and uprising, you know, musicians, young musicians especially, that, you know, that things are possible here in the Middle East, nothing is, there is, there is a struggle, but it's possible. I love that attitude. What advice would you give to people in Vulture TV that want to get out there and get their bands noticed um, from your experiences? Well. We've been based in Dubai all life, so I mean, I'm sure it's, it's a lot easier outside because you get to tour. You can't really, you know, with the whole logistics of touring in the Middle East, it's not set up to, you know, be a touring facility in this region. It's really hard. In fact, 12 years into our career, we did our first Middle East tour uh, only last month. Or was it June, July? Like, uh, Qatar, Bahrain, Dubai, Lebanon, Egypt. So it's really hard work because, unfortunately, everyone's competing with each other and that's band wise and promoter wise like everyone has their issues in the scene but um, with us being able to travel and really do this full time we've taken the initiative to do it thank ourselves. Thank you very much Nerf Self for joining me today on Vulture TV. Um, what have we got to look forward to next from you guys? Well, uh, Apart we... from jumping in the pool because I'm sweating <laughs> like crazy. <laughs> uh, five, I think five or six days from today we're going on an Asian tour with Decapitated. Cool. Uh, Singapore, Thailand and uh, Nepal. And yeah, we just, well, we just want to, throughout the year, at least till the end of the year, we want to do more tours. Uh, we're thinking, we're having slight ideas and brainstorming ideas regarding the third album. The upcoming third album, which should be like by late 2013, around that. We, we, didn't, uh, we don't have a fixed date, but yeah, but we're in the... Brewing. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. It's in the works. Thanks, guys.